What's going on, y'all? Jimmy Mack from Snapper Episode 1 of Season 2 of Justified. I want to say my favorite 45 minutes of the week, but I don't want to be blasphemous to Hannibal. Even though Hannibal's over, I feel like that's the tagline for that. I would just say it's the most fun show I watch right now. You're going to kill me? Do I have to? No. What's up? <gasps> hey, God, ah! Jesus! I have no moral objection to you killing her. You understand, miss, the life you've led. But I need her. Alive. And if I don't comply... Ah! Woo! Uh, you get my friend to the hospital? He's been shot. Let's go. Will do. That's fun. Fun little wrap-up. Let's go, Jill. She needs a doctor. I need guarantees upon my business. All right, look, I've tried to be reasonable. You give me a word in 10 seconds or I shoot you in the head. <laughs> really, I'm walking in. Whatever you're thinking about doing, don't. Mr. Reyes, my name's Dan Grant. I'm the chief deputy of the Miami Marshal's office. There's an ambulance on the way for your niece. You come after Raylan, harm him in any way. I'll kill you myself. I love that. What? I don't understand. I don't know why they give us guns. Raylan, I'm trying to offer you your old job back. I thought that's what you wanted. Right now, I just want to go home and go to bed. You to call for backup. Bo said if he saw anyone but me, he'd kill Ava. And so you took Boyd? It made sense at the time. Thank you. Mm -hmm. What you gonna get next? Probably the same thing. You should think about an Uzi. <laughs> Absolutely. When the cuffs come out, then I'm a black bitch. So you want me to help you with my people? You know, throw my pork rind or uh, some ding dongs? <laughs> if you wouldn't mind. Well, I'm closer in age. Not by much. Well, come on, I just turned 30. Any man Jesus. over 18 talking to me about my period is a pervert. Agreed. Shit, any man, period, talking to me about my period. <laughs> Wrestling and tickling and oh, don't touch me there. It's like a smell's been cast and you don't want to break it. Then maybe you're just dreaming and you don't want to wake up. Well, wake up! God! Damn it! Whoa, okay. Because of you, the right out. Well said. He's he works for them. Splendidly creepy. Hold still, still. I, 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 I am holding still. Well, hold still. Huh? Oh, well, what's his face? I'm lost. Bandage yourself. And he's fucking uh, the stranger in uh, God of War. Um, I didn't know he worked for you. I, I never would. Tell you talking about? Call oh, what line? Huh? Why are you here? What the fuck? What were you talking about before? On what line? Nothing. Put your foot in, Walt! No! This is so fucked. He do anything to you. I so fucked. Like we'll work something out. As for the pervert, you don't have to worry about him no more. Awesome. Here she gave her candy. She's 14, not eight. I love candy myself. If you ever get to talk to him face to face, this might help ease the pain. <laughs> you sure, man? I am. <laughs> if you all oh, still driving the company car, though. All right. I got some misappropriation. You know, come back, run against me. Oh, I could never do your job. I just want to say hey. Uh
Wow! <laughs> I love how we got all this information kind of after the fact, kind of as it's happening. A few minutes ago, for what it's worth, never knew he was a molester. <laughs> all that shooting, that's all you got. The other one got a piece under his coat. And you got one in your hand, for Christ's sake. Yeah, so does the negress. Rachel Coover raises his piece, shoot him. If you'll move a step by the way. <laughs> negress. All right, we're gonna get you out of there. One minute. He left from me. He's on his way out. Loretta, right now I need you to make yourself as small as possible. Yeah, whatever. Get out of here. Can I just have a couple gallons? Look, asshole, I'm gonna tell you one more time. Look at it. <laughs> what the hell? When the pin hits the cap, makes the charge explode, meaning there's a spark, which should be of some concern to a man soaked in gasoline. Normally, I would have just shot you myself the second you pulled, but I am doing my level best to avoid the paperwork and the self-recrimination <laughs> that comes with it. The Lord knows you are the kind that makes it worth it and more. You aim that in any direction, my partner's gonna pop you on the head. There you go. Hey. Slow. Slow. <laughs> it's good. It does taste like apple pie. It does, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, is he dead? I like this guy. No, I don't like him. I like him strong. I don't hate him. Oh. Right. right. Is that what happened to his leg? The trap? <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> it was already in the glass, not in the jar. Why Dickie and Megan drink and be okay? Jesus. You never go outside, Walt. You know that. I didn't know he worked for you. Oh, this is the bad part. You get to know the mystery, Walt. You get to see your Sally Ann again. This is so fucked. Uncomfortably fucked. Strangely beautiful, to be honest. Find the girl. At all. I invited you here because I'm tired and I wanted to have a word before I went to sleep. So what's keeping you? <sighs> <laughs> Absolutely. Knock off the horse shit. For Tom Bergen. Oh, hey Tom, what's up? Am I catching you at a bad time? Always. I know! Alright, All right. that was episode 1 of season 2 of Justified, I have no clue what's going on for it, but I know it'll be awesome. Um, Raylan and, um, or Nona, or Gary, I said they broke up though, they said he, he had his gym bag. Their relationship's on the rocks. I guess they're separated would be the technical term for it. You know, if they're not technically separated. Does that make sense? I think it does. Um, poor Gary. Uh, how you get? How you get her is how you lose her. How, 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 shut up. Um, no, nah, that's not the way. No, nah, that's not the way. I assume we're done with Miami, right? Because that felt very, like, a succinct wrap-up to me. We're done. Feel like we decided this is over. It doesn't work. At the very least, there's nothing more to mine here. Let's move on. 
It helped us build a solid first season, and now we're done. And we move on to season two. I don't know the lady's name, but she was on, uh, what was she on? I've seen her recently. Person of interest. She does she does a lot of character stuff. And she's always really good. And Jeremy Davis is the same way. And god damn it. I should have known once I saw him at the very least. Maybe not her, because she could do a one-off. But him at the very least that this was not gonna be a one-off. God damn it. Poor bastard. <sighs> Poison him. Boo. Boo. You hired a sex offender, or your sons did, and then I called the cops because I have a 14 year old fucking daughter that he fucking harangued, and now I get to die? After you shot me in the leg and trap, you should just kill me then? You stink. Oh, boo. <sighs> I mean, I, I guess though, if you have someone who's willing to call the cops, immediately he becomes a uh, liability. I'm not over it, I'm not okay with that. That's some hustle shit. Then it was like, find the girl? What does that mean? What the fuck does that mean? Because I, I did buy into the fact that she may want to take care of this girl. Because she did ask her about her dad before. And got information on why he's fucking, uh, uh, if he's still a mess, which he is. Are these new beds? Are these the, are these, are these the big beds for this season? As we know, we have her. We have uh, Jeremy Davies. We have the son who's a cop. Or, no, he's the sheriff? Because he was elected. So he's the sheriff, I assume. Hmm. And we have the one who <laughs> said Negress, which I will be stealing at least once in my life. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe. Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jimmy Malcolm. It's time for episode two of season two of Justified. Let's get to it. Let's go. As soon as I come back to bite him. Wood's actually working? I just hope you take advantage of your oh, Gio and his niece got nothing to fear from me, my friend, because my outlaw ways aren't behind me. Just you saying that scares the shit out of me. Yeah, Hold on a second. The more you I gotta go. We're gonna continue this conversation another time. There's nothing to continue because you'll never believe me. Bartender? I think the skin's infected. That qualifies for cruel and unusual. Yeah, well, if you want to get it off, return the 20 grand we gave him. Give it to me to give it to Bo. How do I know what happened to it after that? Not mine. You go in there, you're violating. I'm going to haul you off to jail. That's just chicken shit, and you know Tell it. Tell us to the judge. <laughs> Fine. Take me in. Better than staying here. All right. <laughs> Let's go. Get in the house. Don't think it's going to be you, old man. No offense. Leave her alone. Listen to your aunt. Get back in the house! I hope you get cancer! Already God got it! Damn. I hope you Move get it! Get My apple pie. I want to apologize for not... Oh, you want a little more? I never had a girl. Just those damn boys. I'm not really concerned about the girl. I thought the poison would have hit her already. Um, well, you're also still at a place that puts a piece of paper over the toilet, so what does that tell me? That's sanitized for your protection. I know how much you make, Raylan, come on. I'm sorry? You could at least rent an apartment. Maybe I should buy a house. Well, that's, uh, okay. No, no I, I, I know the name of a very good realtor. Oh, sh shit, yeah. Sometimes I look at you and I never want to see you again. Other times? There are no other times. Just that. <laughs> right. Should I take another shower? You were the one who went for the victory lap. 
Well, hello, Raylan. Winona? Gary. You know, I always forget your office is in this building. We have something in common. We've both been kicked to the curb by this one over here, you know? Oh, shit. Feels like it. Good seeing you, Raylan. He's a mess. Uh, when I was at Marysville, I had conjugal with my husband. Is he taking custody of the baby? Who, AJ? AJ can't take care of himself. That's got to be better than foster care. Hey, hey, don't knock foster care. Look where it got me. That's hilarious. See, once you face down a coal train, facing a load of guns just doesn't have the same fact. Deputy! Don't try it, partner! I'll gut shoot you both before you clear that holster. I'm sorry about this, boys. I hope you understand. <laughs> you sure this is the way you want to go out? I'm sure my baby shouldn't have to ride my rap. That was dope. <laughs> but you knew something was gonna happen. He can have her when I am good and ready. Hey, 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 there's no hurry. You take all the time you like. Jeez, I gotta pee again. Excuse me. Aww. I like her. Clearly doesn't make the greatest decisions in the world, but I like her. Yeah, it was just Timmons. It seems I didn't make it simple enough. It's understandable. You want to break out your wife because they won't let you have the baby. Baby? What? He is gonna deny everything. He doesn't know, rather. You didn't do it one last time, just say goodbye. Well, I wanted to, but she said that would just make things sadder. Oh, you poor Could best. be a regular visitor that knocked her up. It wouldn't be the first time that a couple went at it in the corner of the regular visitor. It's a fucking, it's um, inside the prison. One of them. We don't know that it's a guard. Yeah, yeah. them. <laughs> oh, my God, my legs feel like rubber. You know, if I wasn't about to go through childbirth, I'd really be enjoying this buzz. What is she up to? Did I speak too soon about her? Holy shit. Oh my god, lady. Be careful. Be careful, dear. Damn it. how some batshit crazy diesel like cuts out her best friend's baby and raises it as her own. The news shows never show the stories where the babies die. And I believe me, I've been on 20 runs like that when I was driving the bus. I gotta do the probe before. How long does that take? What the fuck is going on? Cosgrove. Why is it going on? We think he's gonna have her killed. That's the only way he can be certain what? that it doesn't come back to him. You assholes are gonna hang out to drive for this. That I wanna can't get my be union true. rep. That can't be Tell, you tell them that's well, of not course true. it's not true. Well, we have over 20 calls between you and Jeff Timmons last week alone. This, you this think isn't... I can't tell when you're lying? Huh? I'm not. Glenn, if this is true, you tell them how to find that girl. Gail, please. Tell sir. them right now. Tell them! We got it. You, you knocked up an inmate. You hired someone to murder her and sell your child. Now shut the hell up or Tim's going to hit you in the face. What? This is a great fucking thing. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh, would you send your wife inside? You know you're caught. They're not there all fucking hunch. Fucking send her inside. I mean, I guess you'll still get caught once you go to jail and all that other shit, but uh, maybe you fucking, uh, don't believe any of this, baby. I ain't seen the dolls over here. Look to your left on the counter. Son, you pitch over here, huh? Hey! Look at you, sir! You're dead. Oh, it's mighty brave of you, son. Oh, shit. Damn. Hit a fella there. He ain't gonna pull no trigger. It's just lights out. Oh, what, you telling me you're that good? Me. Really? Let's see how this is gonna go. <laughs> Come here. Okay. What's his name, Tim? Good job, Sniper Jim. How did that happen? Honestly, it what? Was. I don't have any idea. Go take a seat. What? What? I was kind of hoping to Aww. meet you. I don't know how that works either, but maybe I could find out for you. That's sweet. That's sweet. Something I can do for you? Oh, no, no. 
No, I mean, you've already done more for me than I could ever. See, he knows already. Which is why I felt like I needed to tell you face to face. I'm gonna get her back. Yeah, you thought a lot about this moment, huh? You say everything you meant to say. Not yeah, pretty much. She left you for me once, right? Poor bastard. Poor Gary. Who were you talking to outside? That was your husband. <laughs> That's a great finish. All right, that was episode two of season two of Justified. Uh, where to begin? I'll start with some of the overarching plot points. Uh, the beginning with, I forget the little girl's name. Um, I forget the mom's name too, quite frankly. But the point is, I wasn't that concerned. About, I was concerned about the girl at first, and then the last episode, in the beginning of this one, I was concerned. Once she drank the fucking uh, cider and didn't die within minutes. Or seconds, quite frankly. I was no longer concerned. If it fucking knocked out her dad, who was twice as big, um, it should knock her out relatively quickly, but it didn't, so everything's all good. And in fact, it seems like old lady's really serious about raising this kid as her own. Never had any daughters, just a bunch of dumbass sons. I can see that. And she did seem fond of her even before she killed her dad. So I'm okay with that. Don't know how I feel about um, Argo and fucking on Helen telling Raylan to stay away because she's an old lady who sells pot, or because she is dangerous. We know both to be true. You know, there's some past beef there of some kind. All right, boy, to stay with Ava. Oh, it felt platonic. Um. I'm glad to see she's giving him a chance to be a good guy. I wouldn't have stayed platonic, but frankly. Um, I judge Boyd all wrong. Not after the first episode, it's just a piece of shit. But post gunshot wound. I might have had the wrong idea about him. I might have had the wrong idea. Wow. He's got a job now. He doesn't want revenge. You know, he's gonna kill his dad. <laughs> revenge over killing his dad that he was gonna kill anyway. <laughs> um, man, it's a shaving up quite nice. My man took the watch, one of his sons, doesn't come back to bite him. That was too, uh, this big juice. Uh, as for the case of the week, case of the week was fine. Anytime they put anybody into their car that they're going to transport, it's going to go sideways. I accept that as a fact. Whether it's just Raylan or it's Raylan and Tim, who is a sniper, even with a pistol. I'm here for it. Anywho, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe. 